All right, I'll introduce us. <clears throat> it's not, it doesn't do anything. To <laughs> yeah. Possible it's delicious. Thursday night. You gotta have a party on Thursday night. I, mean, I don't have class tomorrow. Thursday, Thursday. Uh... Hi there. I'm Jeremy. Hi, uh, Jason. And we're the Balcony Bros. Here to bring you another video. <laughs> what we do. So I guess we should probably explain. We're not doing analytical videos anymore. Nope, not fun. We enjoy doing indie games so much more. And apparently y'all enjoy watching them so much more. Uh, at least according to our views on, on YouTube. So we just figured give the public what they want. And stop doing stuff that bores us. Yeah. So. That's why we're gonna start stripping every up now. <laughs> Jason, no. I was kidding. You can't stop it. Jason! So for this week's video, we actually have three games three. for you. Yeah. Think you can handle that? Three. Internet? Free games. Because nothing's better than free. We'll put links to all the games in the in the comments and you can download them um, for free. And I suggest you play them because they're, they're, they're fun, they're Weird. interesting, and Weird. a little bit scary. Weird. A little bit unique. Yeah, some of them are weird. weird. One of them is weird. Well, we hope you all enjoyed the video. You wanna play first? Sure. It might warm you up to get some crates, <laughs> some, some boxes. boxes. I have to. Oh no. Awesome. You're getting better. Ooh, that was close. You know what, now that I'm thinking about it, I think the other level was actually. I figured out a strategy. <laughs> but you're not going to collect any boxes that way. Or crates. Yeah. Katana's pretty fun. I actually find this game like super addictive. Because it, it reminds me a lot of Hotline Miami. Like it's so fast paced and you die in one hit. But there's no end point. There's no, there's no victory. The victory is... No, I guess there is. There isn't a... There isn't a ah, victory condition per ah, se. Oh, that was lucky. Yeah, it has a big... God damn it. But it's like, it's like kind of the old arcade games victory. Like, you, you just play to, until you can't play any longer. And in the end, isn't that we all, what we God, all... God, what of? happened? Sorry. Yes, that is all <laughs> what we asked ourselves. Um, you killed yourself with your own blade. It bounced off the wall and cut you in half. I can I can do that, but like standing in the blast radius of my bazooka doesn't kill me. No. Nope. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's just I mean you're a crocodile with a shotgun killing floating skulls and little green guys. I mean it's not. Come on, logic. See, like I guess the problem I have with this game is that I really enjoy some of the weapons, but since the whole Motherfucker. Since the whole point of the game is to pick up crates that have weapons in it, like I don't get to in I don't get to like play with the weapons I really enjoy for very long. Well, I mean well that way it keeps you from being overpowered though. Like well, you, would just, you would just keep the revolver the whole time. Yeah I would, and I feel like a badass. Right now I feel like a feudal little tiny man that can't withstand a shot from a disc gun. Well, I probably couldn't either. The thing is, it's like a... Well, I'm a video game character. I sh what? No! I'm so bad I broke the game. Welcome to Texas. It's like 80 degrees three days ago, and now it's like 50-something out here. Yesterday I was sweating on my way to class. This is awful. Oh, but I'm not I guess I'm just in a bad mood today. I'm sorry to subject YouTube to it. Oh, no! Oh no, you let that guy in. That's okay. I didn't let any of the guys in. Shut up. Yeah, I got you. I feel like the guitar Oh no! I think you already beat- I think my high score is 5, so you've already got me beat. I've been playing this a lot lately. It's so addictive to me. Damn it, I want- I hate it when I get Whoa. stuck with the mines because 
you just get, you, it's, since it's so slow to respond, you just kind of get stuck, especially if the next crate you have to get is up on the top level. Yeah. Good shot. I didn't mean to sound so douchey about it. Oh, well done. Bravo. Yeah, doing good. Woo. I think you need doing well. <laughs> oh no! What happens if you let one of the big guys into the fire? They they turn into a big angry fast red guy. Oh, uh, like the, the guy from the Captain the... America movie? Red Skull? Yeah. I slept through half of it. Oh god. I I always feel really stupid when I kill myself with the this <laughs> I'm sure most people do. Ah! Ah! Wasted by my own time. Oh. I love that phrase. It's, a, it's not used enough. It's not. You know, a lot of my favorite phrases aren't used nearly as much as they should. Like when you ask people house tricks. That how? Do, we should. People should still say house tricks. I heard it in a movie the other day. It made me think of you because no one says it other than movie characters and you. <laughs> well. I've been kind of told not to say it anymore. <laughs> By who? By everybody. Ah! Drop down, I dare you! I double dog dare you! Oh no. You can get him, you can get him. Just... Yeah! But this one I think will take a little longer because it's... Well, I mean, that one was 20 minutes. Yeah. Ooh, it's your... Is that your blood or is that the Yeti's blood? God, that golf cart down there, I thought it was like a... A Gallop? Yeti? Yeah, I thought it was no, I thought it was like a galloping cheetah or something. I need sleep. <laughs> yeah, we have a lot of cheetahs in this apartment complex. Shut That's up. why the rent's so low. I, you know, wow, I, he can sidestep quickly. Yeah, I really like why this. Why don't I just sidestep? Because okay. you're gonna run into a tree. Oh I won't. Oh. Ah! I told you. You run into a tree and you get like stuck. You can climb up it, but you can't climb down or get off of it. So at least I've not figured out a way yet. So just press exit <laughs> once we start. You know, like this game freaks me out when I play it by myself because it's like, I there there where, it is. Where? Oh, it's right there. Oh, gee. oh no, it's gone. Yeah. It's, uh, <laughs> I'm coming for you, I, I bastard. Think that, I think that was it. it. Like it had to be. It was huge. That was that was a yeti shape. Look, there's some blood on the ground. My heart sank. <laughs> I'm gonna find you, you big bastard. <laughs> See, Eddie killed my father. It's Moby Dick, but in the snow. <laughs> uh, it's gonna have a scar on his My dad's eye. last words were, son, kill the hell out of that fucking Yeti. He's like, whoa, dad, <laughs> he's we're in a church. <laughs> <laughs> he died in church. He was very profane. Ah! ah! What the hell? No! It's nighttime. Ah! No, no, it's nighttime. That doesn't calm me down. Shh. <laughs> Just go to sleep. It'll just fall asleep in the warm snow. <laughs> oh, Jesus. That's why they call it a snow bed, right? Yep. No, that's a tree. <laughs> if this is what hunting actually is like, why do people do it? Like, this looks awful. Oh! Oh, Jesus, no! Well, that's disappointing. I got really scared. Wait, what? Well, what's the point of having him appear if he's not gonna like attack me? Oh god, damn it! Before we started, we should probably yeah. say like, "Hey guys, anybody watching this video? If you're epileptic, stop watching this video. If you don't like flashing lights and bright colors, stop watching this video. If you have tried acid before, keep watching this video. I tell us if it's realistic or not. Yeah. But anyway." This is uh, a game called Slave of God. <laughs> Let's go! I do kind of like the music in this game. Yeah. But I'm going to turn it down because it's going to be really loud. Hey! Oh, God! Oh, Jesus <laughs> Christ, man! Oh! I don't know why you startled me so much, but you did. We were just playing a horror game. What's up, Ben? How much? How are you? You know what? Here we are! Slave of God. Hey, wait up, friend. 
So we just got let into the club. These are the two bouncers, and you can see that line outside. We should probably preface. This game is an experiential game designed to let you feel like you're at a club on a shit ton of drugs. Yeah. Or you're just a really sad person who sees life this way. And you have some kind of mental disorder. So this is my friend. Where is he? Oh! Sliding up he's, to the he's bar. Going up to the bar. Which is facing away from... <laughs> facing towards the dance floor. Yeah. So you can get sad and watch people have fun with their friends. Yeah, so here's the dance floor. There's my friend. There's some people hanging around over there. There's some kind of, like, horseshoe goal post or something. Let's, uh, let's go get a drink first. Here, hey, barman. The bar that's facing away from everything. Yeah, we got some drinks for me and my bud. Some straws. Some big ass straws. Here you go, man. Have a drink. I really like how the music changes sometimes when you do things. Like when you do Oh, it's all shaking. Oh, wow, you down that. You down that fast. I did. Go dancing, I man. I just put it down over here. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Drink it all. All right, let's go dance on <laughs> the dance courage. floor. Woo, liquid courage. Whoa. Oh, I'm being pulled in by the dance floor vixen. And we're in love. Yeah, don't do it. Woo. She got that stick okay. booty. <laughs> And that paper heart. If people watch this video before the sexism video we did. <laughs> oh god, what's going on? Get out! She's trying to trap you. Oh uh, no, talking no. About boring things. Now her and us, we're dancing together. Are you? I don't know what the hell is going on. We're dancing in circles, we're rotating around each other. Oh, it's like Titanic. We're having an out of body experience. It is. Oh, it's. I can't seem to get off the dance floor either. Once you like, kind of get sucked into it, it's too funky. It actually makes it harder for you to leave. Just, okay, let's, let's. Oh god. So when you go and come up and talk to this guy, just, this like doll thing appears. Maybe it's a girl, and you're like, hey baby, you want to go back to my place? And she's like, I have a kid, and he's just terrified by that. He's terrified by children. So. Well, I mean that's like a cliche of the dance dudes. Oh, very fair. Like, uh, no, I don't want nothing to tie me down. See you later, baby. Let's go see what this person's doing. Hey, guy. What's going on? Are you doing some kind of drugs there? Is that... Sad and oh, my God. What is that? What's happening? Back on the dance floor. No, no, no. I wanted to see the thing that just happened. What happened? Oh, no. She's pulling me in. What is that by the guy? Is that a car? Uh, yeah. A car crashes through the ceiling. Ah, back on the dance floor. <laughs> I can't stop looking at her. She's mesmerizing. Uh, I can oh, try... Oh, Jesus. Oh, shit. Where are you? I seem to have fallen behind the stage? No, I'm in some kind of pit. Um, Moss pit. Oh, what's happening? Ah, uh, it's like I'm in a whole oh. other floor? Alright, that's the crazy wall. There seems to be... Oh, oh, oh dance girl is shooting her laser beams out looking for you. <laughs> I think... I can't tell what the hell is going on with anything. Uh, I want to get up there. I, I'm, I bet there's a way. Because that seems like... My video game instincts are telling me that's a platform I should I should just be able to walk on. But hey, someone tell this guy to stop. It's gonna hurt someone. He's killing my butt. He's yelling at that lady at the bar about her child. Car crash through the wall. He but did the car behind. really crash through the wall, or do I just think it was? Hey man, you doing alright? Why don't you go dance or something? I think he's sad about his friend that died in a car accident. You. But you brought him a drink. I've been dead the whole time. One of the ladies' bathroom. Uh, there doesn't, there's a door. Classic ladies. Yeah, I can't. Get... I go to the man's bathroom. Oh, oh, he's going for it. Yeah, it's he in the that trough. That's the urinal. Oh, it's, it's like a, a ballpark trough. Yeah. Be on the floor. Yeah, be a man. Oh. Be everywhere. Digital pee. Also, that noise it makes—it's like pong. Pee pong. If he doesn't. Uh, oh, I guess I'm done. Oh nope. And a little less. <laughs> God, insane. For sure. There. So yeah. that was uh, Free Game Friday. Don't get used to that name because we probably won't do it every week. Yeah. We'll, we'll see. We're There's not going to do it. There's a lot of free... <laughs> we don't want to... I don't know. I was burned. I've been burned before with, with making plans. Not yeah. plans. Like making commitments. But there are a lot of free games out there. Yeah. Plus, so we'll just do what we want. Balcony and Bros is a fluid thing. Yeah. We can do indie games, mostly indie games. We can do free games. 
that's kind of really all. <laughs> Those are your two options, but we will mix it up. Anyway, um, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a comment, um, like and subscribe, tell your friends, and uh, download these games. Support indie game developers. Yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Tell your friends about us. Sh share the videos. All that good stuff. And yeah. have a great week. Bye-bye, everybody.